I want to tell you about a top water bait. Uh, you know, most anglers are known for being pretty proficient at uh, one or two different techniques. Uh, I'm known for uh, top water, and I want to show you the hammer shad. This little guy right here, this is a uh, Labina Lore Rico hammer shad top water popper right there. It says Rico. Okay, this happens to be the hammer shed. Like the uh, Mask 100 that we were talking about uh, years ago, we did do a, a study on color, looking at forage fish. And we had this one designed. This, this is a clear, translucent uh, bait body to begin with. It has uh, a little bit of gold here on the back. You see that? You see that shiny? A little bit of gold, dark. And then just a hint, just a, just a touch of purple right back coming right down from the back and of course it's got the uh, the red mouth and uh, 3d eyes very very important and it's got ball bearings in there so it rattles uh, one of the things that, I, that I've uh, very prone to do is put a dressed hook on, on the back end of these uh, top water lures this one comes stock out of the box with a, uh, a white with a black wrap on it. Um, why you might ask, we, the last thing that an apex predator fish, say a large mouth, small mouth, sees before he eats a bait fish is a black tail. Forage fish, as a rule, don't have white tails. They have black tails. So, I'll change this out with a black, uh, black feather dressed uh, back treble hook. This comes in a larger size, a little bit bigger. The uh, rear Rico is bigger. But I think at this point I want to talk just, just a touch about uh, technique. Um, most bass anglers, they'll throw top water early morning. Uh, we're sitting here, right, it's uh, midsummer right now. Uh, happens to be great time for top water just absolutely great time but it only lasts for a short time in the morning until the sun comes up starts beating on the water uh, that's fine you can you can then go to the back side of points that are shadowed by the topography and fish until fish or top water or or the jerk bait we, we just did an expose on the uh, mask 100 uh, similar colors, similar colors, very effective early, early morning. So about, uh, let's say, if, if you launch at first light by 7.30, 8 o'clock, the top water goes away, you're, you're going to uh, crankbaits, jerkbaits, soft plastics, uh, drop shot, whatever you're going to do, uh, you're going to fish your strength. So what I'm going to share with you is top water works all day long. Don't let anybody tell you any different. You, you can switch from a popper to a buzz bait and, and next week we'll talk about buzz baits. Uh, you know, I've got some cats out of the bag on, on a buzz bait that, that I'll share with you, try to help you catch more fish. But there, there's a couple of different techniques. You can see uh, Rick Clun when he throws a topwater popper or a chugger, if you will, he is just jerk, 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 pause, jerk, 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 jerk. I mean, just working the heck out of this bait. That's all fine and dandy. Uh, you're running down the bank, you got to move fast, you got to cover water. Uh, but if you're in an impound and you're, you're needing a bite, I'm going to suggest to you that you slow down and use a finesse technique with a topwater popper. Mm, few guys understand that. Here's how it works. Uh, a fish braid, 30-pound 30, 30 braid, uh, a green Power Pro uh, works well. Uh, but you throw your bait up, and you have to be strategic. Uh, a foot off of the bank is perfect. A foot off of a stick-up, a rock, or any kind of a, a topography detail that's in the water. You throw the bait out there, and, it, and it'll go plop, land it as, as softly as possible, and, and let the ripples dissipate. And then twitch it. Don't yank it and pop it. 
twitch it, twitch it, let it sit, twitch, twitch, and then bring it back to the boat. Next cast, twitch, twitch, twitch. Use your finger on the braid. It's just gonna, it's just gonna mimic. It's gonna give a little quiver. You're gonna be surprised how effective that is. And then about 11:30, you go find a uh, main water uh, uh, breaker point and get that get, get the next size out the the little ones aren't too good on uh, uh main lake points uh, get the heavy rio rico out and uh go to town on it now that's uh you want to fish parallel to the point right side left side down the middle and one more pass across to move on to the next one you're going to be surprised that the size and the quantity of fish that are going to come up and is, want to chew on your top water uh, bait. That's that's uh, real real Rico or the Rico Labina lures. Uh, you can catch those online, and uh, this is uh, my design. It's called the Hammer Shad. Give it a try. Been very productive. Won a lot of money on them. Hey, I'm Don McDowell, and uh, that's the cat out of the.